First and foremost, we need to clear up one fundamental misunderstanding. None of the so-called renewable technologies are yet fully based on renewable energy alone. None, not a single one. All require an investment of conventional energy to make them happen, and that is oil, gas and coal. Photovoltaics are no different. However, this doesn't make them any less worthwhile or desirable, because you see, if we have a given amount of fossil fuel at our disposal and we want electricity, we can either burn the fuel in a conventional plant and get back roughly one third of its energy as electricity, because the rest is loss as heat. Or we can use that same fuel to build and maintain a PV system. Recent calculations, including everything from the production of the required materials to the eventual disposal and recycling of the system, indicate that as much as 5 to 12 units of electricity are produced per each unit of fuel energy invested in PV. Again, this is to be compared to a measly 0.3 units of electricity that we would get if we burnt the fuel in a thermal power plant. The overall energy return on energy investment of PV is thus roughly 15 to 40 times as high as that of conventional electricity. Its overall environmental impact, in terms of emissions, is likewise much smaller. In fact, even as far as land occupation is concerned, it has been calculated that modern PV actually requires no more land than coal electricity. And of course, in the case of PV, such land remains virtually unpolluted and compatible with other uses, 